And also the Oakland State Governor Dakora Bjordan has called for an improved synergy with a deep sense of responsibility among security operatives towards strengthening the security architecture in the southwest area of a country for improved socioeconomic development in the area. He made the call in Abiyokutada State Capitol while declaring open the fourth quarterly security conference of the Southwest directors of the Department of State Services held at the Mitros residences in the state capital. The state's abiot zones can only be achieved when we have peace and security. In the last few weeks, some of the things that we've experienced in the state, which I'm not sure uh, you other SDSs are experiencing in your real states, are the issue of, of courtism. It has become so prevalent lately. And, you know, I sometimes sit and wonder that when we were growing up as children that were in university, secondary schools, this was not the case. What has suddenly gone wrong where in our community we begin to find primary school children, organizers, you know, uh, welders, artisans, uh, undergraduates, graduates, all involved in courtism. And I keep on asking, what is the cause? What is the motive behind this courtism? What exactly is driving them? Why are they killing each other? Is there something that they are earning? Is there some kind of reward? Is there, what is the incentive? And I think these are poses and questions for you to look into because then I have decided that we must find a way to provide street lighting all the way from Lagos to Ibadan, the first instance, so that believing that if the Lagos Ibadan Expressway is lit at night, that itself will begin to reduce the occurrence of this kind of nefarious attack. We also are beginning to think of perhaps we should put cameras on that expressway so that we can all begin to share intelligence. If someone escapes from Abekuta and see the car on the express, if he escapes from your state, you can see it. Either he's going to Lagos, escape from Lagos, Mowoi, Bafon. You know, you can probably see, you know, gradually, as we also deploy here, yesterday I was having a meeting with the Minister of uh, Communications and Digital Economy, and we're discussing uh, the project of Ogo State Digital Economy Infrastructure Project and how we can deepen that and ensure that all the southwestern states, you know, buy into that. And that project, the project where we are ambitiously laying about 5,000 kilometers of fiber optic cables, meaning that we are trying to connect every nook and cranny of the state. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.